Speaking uh-huh. of men that you need to do something with, <laughs> Dell Phillips from the Michelis Corporation joins us on the program. Dell, did you hear, just a minute? Dell, did you hear any of that at all? I, I think I heard too much of it, actually. Phew, we. <laughs> all right, he's all yours, Dell. Tell him the truth, Dell. Now, Dell spends most of his uh, time in crawl spaces, and, and so that makes uh, Dell a little bit different. He runs the. Uh, uh, he works in the uh, what, what do you call what do you call it a waterproofing division of the Michalis Corporation. Yeah, exactly. Waterproofing, foundation repair, and mold remediation. And uh, I always, uh, whenever I talk to Dell, I always recommend that you uh, you go and you follow Dell on Facebook because and, and, he and look he will, look up the hashtag Realtors are my friends. That's a good one. That's a good way to pull me up. Also, all right, so you pull that Realtors up. Are my friends. Yep. So uh, follow Dell because uh, Dell has uh, video after video of his adventures in crawl spaces. So anything interesting you've seen the last couple months down in the crawl space or just a lot of uh, crawl spaces that need work? The, uh, I don't want to get pigeonholed in crawl spaces because we do so much basement waterproofing work. The, uh, that's where I'm actually, I was driving up to Noblesville. We're finishing up a uh, basement waterproofing job on Morse Reservoir there. Right, well, let, let, Dell, I, Del, I apologize. Let, let me start over. Dell, since the last couple months, what have you seen in basements uh, for basement waterproofing that fascinates you? The um, Here's what's fascinating to me as far as I'm sitting here pondering probably my biggest question in my business life, and that's why do people put up with wet, moldy basements? Hmm. Why do they? And I, I've come up with the answer as far as its cost, because most people think it's going to cost big dollars and it's a lot of work and it does cost some dollars but it's normally cheaper than you think it's going to be so i mean i always tell people you know as far as get a cost get a bid from us because our bids are free which is amazing so we go from lafayette to bloomington and then Terre Haute to richmond for free estimates just to help people with their basements and i always say it's not going to fix themselves the leaks are not going to fix themselves they're just going to get worse So why not get a free estimate so you can figure out what's going on with your life? And then the thing is, when you sell your house, you're probably going to have to waterproof it anyway because it's going to show up as a major item on a home inspection report. So if you can have physical and peace of mind for while you're living there, then go ahead and have it waterproofed. There you go. And then, uh, you know, I would think it's almost one of those things for the uh, spending the money and investing in that into a completely dry crawl space. Is going to add right to the value of your home, plus you're going to get to enjoy that space while you live there rather than dealing with it, as you mentioned, at the point of sale. Dell, thanks for spending a little time with us. Uh, Dell is all about uh, uh, basement waterproofing, uh, crawl spaces, and you can find him at the Michelis Corporation at 844-FIX-INDY. That's 844-FIX-INDY. It's the Michelis Corporation. Construct, renovate, restore.